Well, these are an eye catcher if ever I've seen one. What? Jerseys. Okay. Absolutely. <laughs> they just stand out like a sore thumb. And what are you, what are you moving them for? Uh, good morning, guys. Welcome back to what is going to be a monster day at the fleet. I'm going to try and buy really high-valued items that sell for an even higher price on eBay. Um, and just kind of leave the, the, the low hanging fruit to the side. Uh, that's going to be my, my only game plan. My goodness, there's a bit of a buzz already in here. We'll see you in there. Morning, guys. How are you, How you doing? Good. That were all the games, hey? That's all I've got at the moment. Yeah. No worries. How much would you do for the lot? All of them? Yeah. I think there's 55, 70, 80. 90 bucks lot. 80, 90. How so much is it in 60, total? So you got 60. So yeah, you had my wife's so here. What have I got there? 10, 20, 30, 40, 45. Yeah, it'd be about right. Um, you want to take all of them, like 75 bucks? 75. Well, it's a few for free. Yeah. Yeah. Would you do... They're all, like, all the ones that aren't open have been literally played once. Gotcha. And then I've, I've gone through all of them and I just pass them off. So they're all, like, immaculate. Would you do 70? I'll meet you in the middle at 75. All of them. How many are there? Five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, four. that's got the whole kit in it. So that was like, yeah, nice. Is like that literally everything still that's there? That's been played, hasn't it? Yeah, literally once I got through it, and then yeah, right. yeah, that was it. No kids or anything like that. Nothing scratched. I can promise you. Yeah, nice. I have a bit of a thing. You'll probably get full price, I reckon, if you if you hold on to it for a little bit more. So yeah, I'll see um I'll see how you go a little bit later. And yeah, of course you can. Go for the rest. It's All easy. good. Appreciate that. Yeah. Now, guys, I don't usually do this, but I felt the need to just turn the camera on in the edit um, and just let you in on what I've missed out on here. Um, that Spider-Man Red Boxed uh, PlayStation game Special Edition actually goes on to sell for over $100. Um, so to be offered $75 for that entire bundle, there were a bunch of other $25 to $35 games in that mix. It would have been an incredible purchase. Uh, and here I am just saying no and walking away from it. So that footage... That you just watched was really hard for me to just watch back on because I was only out there a couple of hours ago uh, and I did let it slip. Fortunately, the person that bought the Redbox uh, PlayStation 4 game was young Jamie, the 15 year old that's always on the channel. He's going to be in this video a little bit later and I'll show you some clip of that as well. But um, at least he was able to pick up a great bargain that he's going to be able to make some money on. But geez, it would have been good to get my hands on it. Look who it is. Jamie, I was just saying, I bought, yep. there was there were nine PS4 games over there before for 75 bucks, yep. and I said no to it, it's yep. like $9 each. Mm. Um, I think I took two of them out of there. Yeah, what would you pay? Um, I got a, no, I, I paid 35 for the two, but one of them was like a special edition Spider-Man. In the red box? Yeah. Yeah. How much so did you pay that for that? One? Um, I paid 35 for that and the Kingdom Hearts. I think I'll get 80 and 25. Oh, was that um, Spider-Man about 80? Yeah, yeah. Well played, Jamie. Usual suspect. Hey, guys. How you doing? Hey, man. How you going? Hey, brother. How you doing? Hey, do you remember me? Ah, uh, what was your name? Logan. Logan. I was in like, I think it was two videos ago. That was on the nice, start. Bro. Yeah. What are, you, what are you looking at? These shoes. I was asking 25, but... 25? What's the souls like? It's US 10. I think I've sold ones for like 50 or 60 before. Yeah, nice. Yeah. I think profits there though. Fees and stuff. I'm trying to get 20 and you might be alright. Did you do 20? Yeah, right, I'll do 20. Dang, you're on. Yeah, yeah. I mean, 270s are always good. The yeah, size yeah. Are good. Also, the size too, right? Yeah, you don't really like finding the smaller ones and stuff. They're a 10, so. Yeah. It's a good buy, my man. Well done. Are you Keep... recording right now? Yeah, yeah. Always. Hey, Get in there. <laughs> well done. See you soon. Yeah, I think so. How are you, buddy? How you doing? Going good. How's yeah, things? Still logging out those movies. What did I tell you about them? Hey? Still doing the video. So, you've got the docks today? Yeah, I've got a couple of pairs. Goodness me, mate. All the caps are $1. This end Jeez, is $1. You've worked through the caps over the last few weeks. Thank you, pardon? You've worked through those caps over the last yeah, few weeks. Yeah, I've got them all back now. <laughs> yeah, they'll go. I had hundreds of them. Oh, they Thank good? Yeah, yeah. Thank you, man. Pretty sure. Thank you very much. 
Um, how much are you doing on the two docks? Uh, look that one. Yep. Both? Yeah. Okay. I'd do... I'd want 80. 80 bucks? Yeah. Like 40 each? Yeah. That's a fair price. Yeah. Um, yeah. What, are you, what, are you, what are you trying to sell them for today, full price? Is that what you're after? Well, I'll do them for you for that if you want them. 40 40? Yeah. Yeah. I'll try and, um, try and sell them off. I'll see if they're still there a little later in the day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Do you do something you want them? Oh, no, I'll see if yeah, you can yeah. sell them. Yeah, yeah. See if you can sell them 50 even. Yeah, yeah, because I reckon they'll go for about 110 or something. Yeah, no doubt about yeah. it. Yeah. I know. I picked them up yesterday, actually. Yeah, they're a nice pair. They're, I like the colour of those. They're in good condition. They are. And these you, aren't too bad. I mean, you've seen them getting around. They've got a bit, bit on the hill, but. You'd get 40 50 a piece here. Yeah, I reckon. Yeah. Hold out, I don't I'll, mind if you know the guys come. Yeah, absolutely. Buy extra, extra, you know, extra stuff. Hundred percent. Nah, I'll keep swinging around, mate. Good to see you. Especially oh, yeah, no, these games. I was curious on. Grandchildren. Grandchildren. Yeah, I hear it. And they're all two two dollars each, were they? Yeah. Lovely. All right, I got three there. Thank you. Find many goodies. Well, I'm doing my best, but I've only got a couple of video games so far. How about you? <laughs> They're all old vintage too, aren't they? Yeah, I got a whole heap at home that I got a list. Really? Yeah. That's incredible. Some monster highs. They, they sell so well, don't they? Yeah. They're, they're brats, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they are. Do you know which ones they are? I don't know their names. Yeah, once you look them all up. Mate. I mean, monster highs, I asked my daughter because that was when she yep. started. Because when she liked the monster high, she was one of the first. Yeah, so right. So she had a monster high party theme. I had to order decorations in from America. It's huge, isn't it? Such a big, and then we sold them like we got all right money for them. But if we kept them now, she would have been a gold. These, mark. these could be you know 30 40 bucks each. Those, What's hey, <laughs> I saw you. Uh, the corner of my I was just more appreciative of the hat that you've got on there. Yeah, it's very nice. Look at it. it. I don't know. Get them. How you been? You good? Yeah, good, bro. What are you up to? I don't know. Spy those RMs, they look quite good. Get them. Are they the moleskins? No, no, I think they're just canvas. You do a little bit of that, don't you? Never. Never? Oh, they're old. They're Man vintage. Australia. That's a vintage tag. Yeah. Good eye. How much you got on these pants, though? How much you got on these? Uh, $7. 7 bucks. Oh, take it. Take it. No, I don't sell clothes. I don't either. We don't sell clothes. What <laughs> I don't do you either. Need? But they're great. Oh, no. They're only 7 bucks. We don't. I'm looking at this. You know I've got a lighter collection? Yeah. I'm thinking I could put oh. like, lighter, 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 lighter. That's a no-brainer. It's no brainer. And then you can put a stack up the top there. Yeah. Maybe I'll just offer 10. I don't really want it. I'm going to offer a five for these because I'm a stinge. Yeah, <laughs> I offered eight. What'd you yeah, do? 10. Did you? Oh, really? How do I went to school with you? Did you? Did you? Go to Helen's house? I went to Narain. Narain? Yeah. Oh, so I was in 15 for both. Oh, you might have seen me around yeah. there. Yeah, yeah. No? The 10 and 5. Park I live in. Yeah, that's my, my local area when I was growing up. Yeah. That's crazy. We went to the same party. Oh, we no doubt. No doubt. But you don't get the good used to party it up. Look. Bit faulty there, is it, Maddie? Thanks, so. Well, Thank I just don't think I want it for 15, but 10, I'd. Ooh. Oh. Could be hey, anything. Now. Hey, now it's, uh, yeah, it's whatever I want. <laughs> Could be anything now. <laughs> Look, you had. Um... Well, I got him for eight, so. Oh, that's, oh, that's a steal. Yeah. This time of year. You're actually, love it. actually, those are. Uh, is that a blow mole? I don't know. I thought it was a light up one, but it's not. It's a blow mole. These, these can be worth a fortune. Uh, well, wow. he'll, go, um, he'll go well with our. We've don't got you another see light the, up one the pickers here. in America buying those? No. You never see that? No. Oh, you'll start seeing it now. Yeah, right. That's awesome. Well done. Oh, yeah. Good Have stuff. Day, yeah, you too. See you later. Would you do five on these? Would you do ten on this? No. Oh, there's fifteen dollars. I, I, I accidentally rubbed. Oh, so so seven though, no? I accidentally rubbed the thing off. I didn't. Do you have the? Pen? Okay, you can have five. Can I have ten? No. I, I rubbed the thing off. I'm sorry. I didn't. It's I just, all right. The because the easy to come off. Okay. 
My bad, I'm sorry. It's alright. Jeez. <laughs> Got some cool stuff here. Yeah. Boxes. This is right up your alley. It really is. You like these little little trinkets? I do, I do. Can always hey, hey. Oh. You, you going you going for this? The assassin. He, look, he smelt in my pocket. Yeah. There oh. was a DS. He smelt it. Where'd you get the DS <laughs> from? <laughs> Trust Jamie to sniff out yeah, Nintendo Jamie's DS. Good, yeah. <laughs> hey, no, that's in good um, condition. Twenty bucks. I got it for. Yep, I've, uh, I've it's, done that. It's instant. I just bought some pants that I don't normally well, grab. What I did was I paid 25 bucks to come in early and parked over there. Oh, <laughs> did you? So you've been in here for a fair I got while. Gold, I got gold. Oh, yeah, did you? I, coming in early, like we should be doing it every week. Really? So you pay the fee? I don't know how to hey? sell this for okay. You one. Pay the fee. You can't. You're a bit too big. Oh, I'm a bit too big for the boot. Put me in the passenger seat. I bought a gold necklace for five dollars. That's worth eighty. Wow. Like I can go melt it for eighty. So. And you're telling me that if you didn't pay the twenty-five initially, that would have been sold. Yeah. Someone else. Gold dealers. Oh wow. That's clever. Definitely worth it. Pay the twenty-five, not even sell the boot. I'm actually going to come down here and sell in a week or two. Yeah. Yeah, I got so much stuff. I'll help you set up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah no. You boys can jump I'll in. I'll bring me. you a coffee and help you. Yeah. Set I'll be up. your videographer. <laughs> yeah, you will be. Well, actually, you might be, Jamie. I might need you for that. Yeah, actually. Yeah, I might no. need you for that. I'm 50 bucks an hour. Yeah, <laughs> you're hired. Actually, 50. Oh. Who's this guy? Humphrey. That's Humphrey. Without any eyes. Or clothes. Or clothes. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Or hat. He's lost his hat. I know. He's a naked bear. Wow. Tough to find though, Humphrey. He is, yes. Yeah. I've hung on to it for a long time and I said to myself, do you really need to be keeping that? Time to go. Yeah. 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 yeah I've only got oh, very good. Well, good luck today, hey? Yes, yeah, thank you very much. Happy shopping. Guys. Absolutely. They're in good condition, aren't they? Yeah. Didn't happen? <laughs> no. Oh, that would have been amazing, hey? Yeah, yeah. yeah wow. So I'd say maybe I've worn them maybe five times. Five times, yeah. How much are you selling them for? Uh, I'd give them to you 15. 15? Yeah. Would you do 10? Yes, yeah, I'd do 10. Let's do 10. Yeah. Five wares isn't too bad. No, no. That's awesome. So I thought that was a pretty decent pickup. Kathmandu, always a really good brand. I actually have a lot of success with the hiking shoes and, and also like the combat boots. Um, sort of like combat style like Doc Martens, um, any sort of Western style boots. Um, so as much as I love my running shoes, uh, I'm also looking in those sort of categories. Hiking, combat, uh, cowboy. So yeah, 10 bucks. I thought that was a bit of a no brainer. We should be able to convert it into maybe 40, maybe 50 bucks. That's the only hat you got left? Yeah. Yeah, no stress. Just grab the one. Appreciate it. Thanks, heaps. Have a good one. Well, these are an eye catcher if ever I've seen one. What? Jerseys. Okay. Absolutely. <laughs> they just stand out like a sore thumb. What's the story behind them? Story. Yeah. Signed jerseys, mate. Bit of memorabilia. Queensland Reds, Brumbies. Very cool. Yeah, they are. Reds, Br Brumbies. What size are they? Size large. Oh, I don't know. A lot of people get them framed, so they yeah. sort of, they want the smaller ones. But yeah, of course. Well, if you want to walk around it, you could probably pull it off. Is the Brumbies, because uh, that's obviously 35 out of 70, is that the same with the Brumbies? Is there a certain... Yeah, the Brumbies is... Um... I'm not sure how many of them made at least. I'm not sure. Yeah. They're just corporate ones, so they might, but there's not a lot of them. I used to work in sports meds, so I used to get them. Gotcha. Um, but there's some pretty good players on there, so. Yeah, so, absolutely. From what, 18, year, so. what year was that? 20, oh, 2018. Yeah. Yeah, so. okay. Nice. And what are you, what are you moving them for? Uh, $50, they are. $50? $50 bucks? each. Yeah. 50 each? Yeah, okay. It's an air dang, fully signed. Very, would you do 80 for the pair? 
Um, I'll do 90. 90? You want to meet in the middle. Let's do it, mate. No dramas. Yep. How you doing? That's the way. So I reckon that might have been arguably buy of the day, those two jerseys. I'm going to be hard pressed to find anything as good as that. Um, well, you never know. You can't you never say never, I guess. Um, but $45, uh, the Brumbies jersey is actually a 2017 jersey. Uh, and then the Reds jersey is obviously 2018. Um, so that'll play an important part for when I go on to try and list it up. But my initial thoughts without doing any comp research into it was that $45 was just a really good price to be able to convert into some significant profit. That's the way I want to be buying my items from here on in. Um, I've spoken about it quite a bit, but just spending more to make more individual on per individual items. So that jersey, my both of them, I feel like it could be 150 bucks each, which would be $300 for a $90 investment. And I think that's definitely worthwhile. So pretty stoked about it. A lot more to pick from, a lot more to try and find. So let's get back in there and we'll see what we can find. Are these phones any good or no? Yes. They work? Yeah. I've just upgraded. That's at A. It's what you already It's all being factory reset and everything. Factory like reset yet. too. What um what Samsung was it? Um A12. A12. Yep, yeah, and that's a Nokia. I don't know much about that one. Okay. That's my brother's, but they both as far as I know they both work, so yeah. yeah. Okay. What were you doing on those? Um, 35 for the Nokia and 50 for the Samsung. 35 and 50? Yeah. yeah, that's not bad at all. You got a cool little lot of collectibles here, guys. Yeah, yeah it's just a matter of uh, buying it or, you know, collecting it over time. Absolutely, you know? yeah. It's an eclectic, uh, an eclectic it's mix. Thing, yeah. It's awesome. Any size 12s? No, I think the biggest men's I've got at the moment is 9. They're the first ones to go. Of course. Yeah. I was shocked <laughs> if you said yes. Yeah. <laughs> Very cool, though. Are the um, dunks a flat price or are they per the different colourway? All 80. All 80. These ones are 40 because I've been worn a couple of times. Okay. But um, everything else is. And all of those are new, are they? Yeah, all brand new. All authentic. Oh, yeah, cool. Smell and touch and feel. Yeah, oh no, I could already tell, hey. You can, you can pick them pretty soon, yeah, can't you, yeah. if, they're, if they're not legit? Yeah. Fit you or whatever, Absolutely, but, yeah. it's a great collection, and you got more in the. Yeah, it's in my house. Oh, really? Geez, well, I love. Yeah, that's, that's unreal. <laughs> really? And are you just phasing out, or are you? No, we used to resell. Yep. Um, but just because you can buy them everywhere now, yeah. like stores wide, like it never used to be like that. No. So we used to kill it as a resale. Yep. But um, just getting rid of them now, so it's just you can buy them. <laughs> Um, Which put them on a website or we put them on we eBay? Have, or, um, yeah. like our, uh, we have Instagram page and stuff. Yep. It's just because we work full time as well, it's hard to do all time, so market seems to be the way to go. Absolutely. Super smart. Yeah. Get it done here. <laughs> Cash it. as well, right? Exactly. <laughs> That's sick. Nah, it's an awesome collection. How much on the shoes, guys? Uh, 50. 50? 50. Those ones are 20. 20 on those? Yeah. Yeah, right. What size are those? Like 200. US. Nine and, Nine and a half. Yeah, nice. All right. Thank you very much. Tell me about. Tell me about it. Hey, bro. How are you? How you doing? Yeah, good. How you doing? Good, good, good. I'll let you have the bag as well. Oh, I don't need that oh, bag. Okay. It's a good little collection. <laughs> Man, I thought, why not? Yeah. It's good to go. Yeah. Like, Look into it all. Twenty bucks. Yeah. Oh, twenty-five for the whole. Yeah. I saw it this morning and I was like, thirty bucks. And they're all numbered. Yeah. Is there a bit of interest in that? Was there this morning? Some people looked at it. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Anything Lego, I guess, right? Yeah. yeah. That's why I bought it. That's awesome. <laughs> How are you? I didn't realise you were so tall, I'd never give you any cheek, mate. <laughs> yeah, I know. Everyone gets deceived by the height. But uh, how are you guys? Good? Yeah, yeah. really good. Yeah, nice. Unreal. Uh, it's been fun today. It's, there's a lot of good stuff, it seems. It's very busy today, though. Today is. 
today is, I think it's because it's like pushing Christmas, right? Yes. Um, so it just seems like it's a lot more vendors, a lot more stuff. Right. So I How's just, Courtney going? She's going really well. Yeah, she's loving it. She's um, been a year now, January 9. Yeah. It'll be a year that she's been there. And I said to her the other day, how are you finding it all? And she's like, yep, ready to keep going and get stuck in a year two. So it's, <laughs> it's exciting. Yeah, hopefully we can grow her to a point where she's full time. Um, she can really take over more, more control, do more things. So we'll see how that goes. But well, we haven't started our business yet. You have to. What's stopping you? Oh. Oh, is that right? She's the expert. Is that you're the expert? <laughs> so we we've collected a, a lot of stuff, but yeah. we just haven't started it yet. Yeah, right. So when do we start? January one. Just gonna bite the bullet and do it. You do, yeah. It's it's that's really it. You just got to go right. Today's the day. It's going to be five a day from here on in. Because you don't need to be listing out thousands of items to make a few sales. No. If you just bought the right items and then listed them, they would turn over, and you'd have more cash to buy the next set of right items. Yeah. So it's not really a volume game. It's more a quality game. Quality stock will always sell. Even if yeah. you've got one item in your store and you've just started, if it's the best item in the world, you list it up. A lot of people out there are going to want it. Mm. So you just have to price it competitively. If you're a new seller maybe the mid-range price or maybe the lower end just to start off with to get the sale. And then you get a few reps under your belt, you make a few really good sales and then the algorithm starts to promote you more because you've had a few positive feedbacks. So I would initially look at all of the stuff that you've got at home and go, what is our 10 very best items that we could list up? Yeah. And then try and list them up with a, a good match title off somebody else that sold one and then just really competitively price it because you know it'll go. And then you get excited because you make a sale and then you're like, here we go, we're off to the races. And you just keep trying to list up quality only yeah. and just discard the rest. Yeah, that's the secret. But you got to start. Yeah. It was um, after a uh, financial year, that happened. Then after a holiday, that oh, happened. All right. Give me a hard time. <laughs> could, what, what could you do today? Could you list an item today? Uh, yeah. Could. So what's stopping you? Well, she's got to start up the eBay. That um, takes five minutes. <laughs> So, I'm not going to win here, Jamie. Help me out. <laughs> Once you get started, you get hooked. I, I agree. Start today. You start know, today. As they say, um, what is it? Day one or one day? Yeah, day one or one day. Yeah, we'll yeah the, the way around. The Today's day one. We, when we first started this, it was like, yep, and we had a game. Whoever come out with the highest. Yeah. And then I just got, yeah, we just kept building and building and building. So how much stuff have you got at home? Um... Two big bookcases of DVDs. DVDs. Yep. We've got, uh, yeah. So a few hundred items, right? I think I'd go about it as just finding your highest value items. Definitely. Listing them straight away. And when you get some few high dollar sales and then you put your tracking on and eBay says you've delivered them, then they'll just start to promote you more and more and more. Yeah, because eBay needs to see when you're new that you're fulfilling the whole process yeah. correctly. Yeah, you're facilitating posts per when you said you would. The buyer uh, saw it, they've given you some positive feedback. Once that starts to roll, eBay can trust you a little bit more and then the, the more listings that you put up, the quicker the process for you to get paid out and all the so rest of it. So um, if you send something to someone yep. and they say that they haven't received it, does eBay... They'll take the buyer's side unless you can prove it. That you, they've got so that's it. What so if tracking. you have a tracking number, then you're fine. Yeah. But say if you send something without the tracking number, they can just say, oh, we didn't get it. And then you you lost the case. You won't win. So you need, you need tracking pretty much on 99% of your items, basically. But if they're not like cheap DVDs, you generally would, because you're selling them for $20 plus, um, so you can whack a tracking number on it. Um, and all of the flat rate postage satchels with Australia Post have tracking, um, but it's just making sure you're always safe with that number. Yeah. Um, but also too, just learn, fumble through it, make mistakes, because I've made 100 of them and I'm still here selling. Jamie's the same. I remember yeah. the one that um, Courtney made. Um, what was that one that Courtney made? send it to the wrong place oh yeah yeah no, I did i've that. done that i sent two cameras exact same i'm in the process of, of doing that right now i sent two dvd bundles to different people uh, and now i'm trying to get them to send it to each other <laughs> and i'm paying the postage for those two people so and then you have to manage it to make sure you get good feedback yeah and then i'm trying to be super like communicative yeah. to say hey to be nice and yeah. not try to come across as rude yeah, yeah. yeah. so look you make a lot of mistakes and it's just part of it yeah. But don't stress it. And also shoot me a message if you have any questions at any point when things get curly. Because I'm always right. helping whenever I can. Thanks. So, nice. yeah. But it's great nah. watching your... Um, it's great watching your... Uh, yeah, shows. I appreciate you tuning in. And I can't wait until you sell your first item. We'll let you know. Yeah, let us know. Thanks. See you later.
Nebraska. Nebraska Huskers. That's cool. It's got there. Oh, eighty for that. Yeah. Jesus, nice. Yeah. Is it uh? Is it, over for it, so. is it women's? Oh, it's unisex. Unisex, yeah, yeah true. Yeah. And then the Lakers too. Who's this? Is this your? My daughter's oh, your daughter. Juice, yeah. Gotcha. How much are you doing the Jordans for? One hundred and fifty for those. Yep. Two hundred for those. She's only more than one. Two hundred on these. Yeah. That nice, aren't they? With that felt there. Yeah, that's nice. Jamie knows his cameras. We've got a Nick on here. What are you? What are you? What are you seeing? What are you doing on the camera? How much do you have on it? Twenty. What is it? Just a Nikon F sixty five. Yeah. I got the film there too. Looks very clean. Mm. Love when it's a <coughs> is that a double A and hope those they're annoying. They're expensive batteries actually. Are oh, they? Right. Yeah. Interesting. See if we The lens can do just as well, I know. I was probably, oh, if I can get it working, I'll sell it together. Yep. Um, if I can't, I'll sell that off and then that for parts. Yeah. But I'll get the money for 20. True. Yeah. And then, is there anything in the bag? There's like some film. Oh yeah, you got your film in there. Yeah. But that's pretty um, standard. Yeah. Yeah, nice. It looks really clean, I think I'll get it working. Nice. Yeah, I'll grab that one. I'll grab it for 20. I'm very, very happy with what we're able to grab today. Um, look, I think a big focus for me moving forward is to try and not buy ultimate quantities of stock, but rather the right stock. And I think that's a really good example of just cherry picking some really good items. Um, what I do need to say is what my focus is at the moment with this Black Friday sale, what's been really great to see is that I've sold so many items that have just been dead stock that I've had for years on end. And so when this sale ends on Monday, I'm also going to be placing a large focus around cleaning out some more of my old stuff so that'll be going out to like maybe running my own garage sale or it might be coming down to the flea market setting up a booth and trying to push out more stock i've got 2700 items in my store and i've only sold a thousand items in the last 90 days and you really want to be sitting around 50 percent ratio so if you've got say 2000 items in store a thousand items is kind of okay so that means i've got to clean out about 700 dead loose items and i know that i've got them at home um, that's why they aren't selling. They're still sitting in my actives tab. So I'm going to place a large focus on that over the next few weeks. Hence the reason why I bought only just a few really good items in this video today. So I'll document that process of cleaning out the old stock over the next few weeks. Just buying the right stuff. That's the biggest thing, guys. Don't worry about anything else. Find quality, list quality, sell quality. Um, appreciate you being here for this one, guys. Go and watch this flea market video right here because it was a good one. We'll see you soon.